Claudia, give me three running backs outside of the Yahoo top 10 you should target in your fantasy draft. I like it. I have a little theme going on. I like number right? two a lot. Yeah, me. okay, okay, <laughs> we agree on that one. So not just dominant backs, but dominant backs on a squad where you can't really trust the quarterback or don't know if you can trust him right yet, like right? Because Miles Sanders no longer on the Eagles. We were talking over 1,200 yards, 11 touchdowns with that squad whose quarterback you could trust. So now he's on a team where you have a rookie quarterback, don't know what to expect from Bryce Young, so I think he'll have a big year. Aaron Jones, I'll let you talk a lot more about him, but basically he's getting disrespected. He shouldn't be this far down. Yeah. He hasn't been in years past. He can catch the ball better than any running back and he can get it done on the ground. And then Najee Harris, a lot of people were afraid to bet on him when it comes to injuries and also just production overall, but he proved them wrong last season and we should see even more so I think this season through the air and on the ground. I like the way you think. Let me see who doesn't have a good quarterback. The way I went was who has the best offensive lines. Top 10, top 10, that's a kryptonite, but I'll get to Brees Hall. <laughs> With Jameer Gibbs, the Lions traded up to 12 to get him yeah. after they traded away DeAndre Swift. This guy was a leading rusher and receiver at Alabama. He's fast as can be. He has seven of his last 10 games are in a dome because of playing at home, mm -hmm. on the road at Minnesota, games against New Orleans. So it works out for him. And a top five offense, great offensive line, and a really bad defense, he's going to get a lot of touches. And he certainly, with Jamal Williams and DeAndre Swift gone, that's 400 touches vacated. Yeah. He could total 300, no problem. For sure. Aaron Jones, you mentioned his route running. I think with Aaron Rodgers gone now, that'll be back to Matt LaFleur's offense we saw two, three years ago where he thrived. Now, he certainly has that big shadow of A.J. Dillon that'll lurch touchdowns away when it gets to the red zone. But he can get it done. Seven touchdowns. He can make it happen with his hands. Mm -hmm. Brees Hall, now that's the system goes into Aaron Rodgers is now with New York. They're going to have a lot of leads to protect it from him. Really fast back, great route runner, and I love the value you get there. I like for both of us, number three was like the highest draft pick. We go value. Yeah, of course. We go value. We want you guys to win your fantasy draft.